Hey guys. Fuzzy, battling undead. Slightly intense. Let's go. The sound is off. My apologies. There we go. Unprofessionalism there. At its worst. <laughs> okay. It's kind of less intense now. I think I'd killed most of them in the last part. Whew, have I got time to breathe? Have I got time to save? Yes. Oh god, I'm dead. <laughs> right, okay. Let's take these things one thing at a time. Right. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Or is it just battle music? Oh, I'm not getting attacked. Phew. Okay. Let's level you up, then, Emoen. You have reached glorious level of two. You have no proficiency slots to put in. You do have, however, some skill points. Since you are so bad at opening locks, I am going to bump that up to 40. And I'm also going to bump up fine traps, because that will be useful in a later game. Stuff. You have dinged. How close is everyone else to dinging? Dinging? Dinging. Yes. Uh, farewell. You've already dinged. And, uh, you've got a fair way to go as well. Okay, now. We've saved it. Let's try and rest. Without getting attacked. Resting cutscene. Always nice. Wow. That was fun. This is what I've been waiting for. It's been a bit slow going so far. I have not particularly healed. I forget that it doesn't... It doesn't heal you, like, when you sleep, does it? It, it, it does on Ice Rendell. I'm so not used to this still. Right. Okay, fine. Heal yourself. Uh, That'll do for now. We've got one left, in case we get ambushed. I'm sure we've still got some potions and we're like, I don't like that it's night time. Everybody knows that at night time zombies are ten and undead are ten times worse, but I've already been playing too much Dead Rising, but it scares me all the same. What? That looks... You can pick this up. You have got composite longbows. Have I got composite bows for everybody now? Shame. Would have been nice if I hadn't, to be honest, because then I could be like, Oh my god, composite longbows! <laughs> okay. What are you good at again? Just small sword. Lame. Still don't like the sounds I'm hearing. Fortunately for you, you can't really hear the game audio. It is scary. Also, it's got halberds. What do they count as? Spears. I don't think anyone can use spears. You can't, can you? You have large sword, bow, and axe. You can't. You can you? What do you, what do you use? Blunt weapons. That's right. I didn't give you spear. I gave you large sword and bow. Okay. In which case, mm, keeping a halberd on me is kind of pointless, but I'll keep it nonetheless. It's still interesting. Whatever. Although, actually, equip your sword. Right. Maybe this wasn't the best place to come to. Maybe I should head to Nashkel and come back here later when I'm potentially supposed to. Who are you? Fine, sir. Let's just save and talk to you. I have a habit of saving a lot, you may have noticed. I don't trust people. Wait, Ferris, wait up a minute. I moved, missed to have a word with you. You're adventures, are you not? Yes, for adventures. Why should you care? That's good, then. You see, I am an adventurer of sorts. Of course, I'm not very fond of battle. I like to pilfer objects from ruins and monstrous lairs, try my best to avoid getting hurt. Anyway, I have something that might interest you. I have a gem in my possession, a magical gem. I have no use for it, and I can't get the price I'm looking for from anyone I've met. Would you perhaps be interested? Perhaps you could tell us what the gem does. Of course, it is a gem of true seeing. It allows you to see the truth in all things. So do you want it? 
I'm selling it for a thousand gold, no more, no less. How about selling it for less than a thousand gold? I can't afford to sell- oh, okay, fine, we can't afford it. And you phase out of existence. I'm just gonna reload that for the simple fact. Well, I'm not gonna kill him, because that's a evil thing to do. But, I wanna see if I can do a slightly less evil- I mean, okay, so it, granted it is only slightly less evil. To see if I can pickpocket him. Ah, pickpocket succeeded. No way. I stole a gem from him. It's not a gem of true seeing, but I'm going to save her. I'm quite happy with her pickpocketing skill there. I wonder if he's got anything else, or whether he was just going to give me a turquoise gem. I think he was just going to give me a turquoise gem. I think he is a lying little toad. Go and kill that skeleton. Go and kill him. Go and kill him. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Got a nasty halberd there. Okay. Pick up some arrows for me, my friend. Yeah. I think he was just going to do me out of some... a large quantity of gold. Let's just... See if we can pickpocket him again. Or whether he was... Yep. Literally, that's all he had. I'm surprised I even managed to get away with that, to be honest. I mean, he's clearly a thief, so he must have a... Pretty good... Okay. Since he's attacking me, let's just attack him back. And I've saved it, and I've pickpocketed a gem from it. He's not very good at fighting, so he says, so... Uh, let's see what he's got on him. <laughs> Since we can. He's running away. Coward. He's obviously got a fairly good armor class. He's probably got a good dexterity score, that's why. God damn it. Come here. Come on. If you're leading me into more and dead, I am going to be annoyed. You are. Cheeky little bugger. Get your ass here now. Right. I meat slapped him. Now getting attacked by more skeletons. Let's just attack those. Since we can. Damn, they look scary. Their eyes are glowing at night time. They are creepy as hell, man. Why is my whole party not attacking? Attack! Fools. Right. See what he had on him. See if he had anything worth what? No. Okay. Well, that's. I'm not going to kill him because I don't like just killing random people. It seems silly, but that proves, thanks to Imwen's rather surprisingly good pickpocketing skills, there, uh, that he is just a sneak. He is a sneak through and through, and he didn't have anything more worthwhile but a stupid turquoise gem. Let's leave Orcaster for now. Let's go and head down to Nashkel. Into this purgatory area, as I like to call them. Hmm. All right, all right. That was intense. I'm really proud of everyone. She did a very good job. What are you? Ogrillon. Who or what are you? No man. No matter, should I say. Because you are going to feel the wrath of my ranged weapon awesomeness. He doesn't look particularly happy to see me. Perhaps I should... Like, kite him. <laughs> Run. Shoot. Cowardly and lame. Oh, oh god. Uh, Khalid, I really don't want you to fail fear checks right now. I do not. You are going to die. You ran off screen. I can't even save you if I wanted to now. 
Never mind. I don't. I still haven't found a weapon for her to use. I forget that weapons break in this. This is not going well. She is going to die very soon. Also, Galid's dead. Let's reload. Let's go in more prepared. What do I mean by prepared? Uh, fully healed would be a good start. Or more importantly. Ugh. Yeah. Okay, I'll heal. Uh, this may be a bit tedious, but it's worthwhile doing, trust me. Rest without getting attacked. Good. Uh, you're only like down like three health, one health. Okay. Save. What we will do is when we see them, we shall get Jahira to cast Bless. Let's use some spells. Use my Fighter Druid to her full potential. Thank God for auto pause is all I say. It has the reactions I do not. And my reactions aren't bad, but the game detects when there are enemies, whereas I do not. I would be dead <laughs> many more times over. Right. Use that wand of magic missiles you have, Imran. You. Cast Bless on... Oh, it's a single target. Arr, I thought it was multiple. Okay, just shoot. Oh, it is, it is multiple target. My bad. Sweet. Oh, we owned it this time. How much experience did he get there? 175. Ah, oh, I thought it said 675. I was like, yo, what? It wasn't that difficult. A scroll. Uh, you have no inventory. Oh, why do you never have any inventory room? Yes. Go grab that scroll for me, good lady. Now which one was it? Uh, that's bounty notice. My dearest Marianne, the road has been difficult, but I have arrived safely here in Am. I would think it would be wisest if I return by the sea, however, perhaps some time after the first snows have fallen. I trust this letter reaches you. The half thing I had to carry it has, tr has struck me as an honest enough chap. Always and forever, row. So, he's safe. The halfling who delivered the letter, or he got to deliver the letter, clearly isn't. Oh, he's up here. This looks like him. With another Ogrilon in sight. Uh, okay, everybody attack. The one of magic missiles was pretty nice. Do that again. Do it again. Do it again. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Sweet. Go and grab some loot, Emma one. Just a gem. This must be the poor halfling guy. <sighs> well, that's a bit of a sad discovery. But at least we know this rogue guy's safe. Maybe I should go back and tell her at some point that he's okay. Or at least we think he's okay. What's over here? Sort of like some kind of swamp. Is that house underwater? A submerged house. You have no longer idea how long it's been deserted. How very mysterious. Anyway, uh, I need to go. My time is out, so goodbye.